welcome back guys to my channel today i'm gonna talk about this bad boy over here yeah it's gay time so before we continue on to this video please make sure to subscribe to my channel hit that notification bell for more updates so here i go so before I continue talking about the Nintendo 2DS, I just want to share with you guys a brief gaming history. My, 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 my gaming history. So I started uh, with uh, a family computer. It was given to me by my father. I asked him to brought home a family computer one summer day. And I didn't expect that uh, he would go home and with, with that console so it made me happy and I love those games uh, play there the classic Super Mario game Adventure Island Punch Out and what else Mad Max uh, and uh, yeah but I haven't had the opportunity to finish them all I just watch my father play most of the time because uh, he's an expert in Super Mario Brothers the classic one so if you want to challenge him he knows all the one out the, the free uh, lives so classic classic man and then uh, the next uh, experience that I have in gaming consoles was the Game Boy although it's not that attractive to me and it was expensive during that time but it was a kind of cool thing to have but I didn't have one so, but it's fine because uh, uh, it's not really recommended for my eyes because have some light on your head so and then the next one would is the I, I've had the chance of playing Sega my uncle has one uh, the 16-bit Sega I played uh, what I love playing there was the Mortal Kombat and uh, I think Tekken there's one in the Sonic Sonic game. Uh, I forgot the, the title. And then the next one is the PlayStation 1, which I was uh, blown away during that time. Especially when my uncle plays the Resident Evil. The Resident Evil game, the first one. Wow, it was really. The graphics for me during uh, that time is it's like oh, phenomenal. So, uh, that was really a memorable, memorable console. And I, I love uh, watching my uncle play the Resident Evil. I, I tried playing it once, but I suffered. Ah, ah, ah. Maybe I'm still young playing it. So, well, that, what, that, that was the last. And then, I got busy with life. So I wasn't uh, uh, keen on playing games. Uh, I do play games like the trees, <coughs> mobile games, like the one, the games that are installed in your phone, uh, that sort of thing. But I uh, was never really addicted to it, I must say. So maybe because I have too much to think about, life, I think. But anyway, let's get on with this console. So, uh, this console, I uh, actually this is not mine. This is my brother's console, and my sister also has this one. They are the only ones that my father gave this console. He didn't even think of me, but that's fine. So anyway, he's not playing with it, so I think it's mine. Thank you, brother. So this was uh, given to uh, given to him, I think way back in 2014-2015, I cannot uh, remember, back then. And they are not playing it, which is for me kind of weird. So I opened it once in 2015, just uh, charge it, play the loaded game. I think there's a demo play game demo games here sorry demo games here then I played it for quite a while and then um, 
Then I stop. <laughs> I don't know why. Maybe because uh, I have another hub hobby then, or I like playing sports. Uh oh. But this was revived during this quarantine because I don't have much to do. So I got it from my from our home. But guess what? So this was the box that uh, came with the console. Uh, if my memory serves me right, the original charger of this is quite heavy, but it was lost. I don't know it was, if it was misplaced or it was thrown to the bin accidentally. So, on my first week of getting this from our from my parents' home, uh, I haven't had the chance to play it. So I bought a like charger. This is not the original charger of the of this console uh, because it was lost. So I have to wait for this for two weeks. I ordered I ordered this from Shopee for only I think uh, 300, 250 to three hundred pesos. In Philippine peso so I think that's uh, roughly five I uh, no, no, no. yeah five to six dollars so uh, while waiting for this to arrive so that I can play the game because there's no battery in it low bat I also ordered the silicon case I hate the uh, I don't want the the hard case metal crystal metal I also bought this from Shopee for I think 100 uh, roughly 100 130 pesos to 150 Philippine pesos so roughly like two dollars is dollars yeah and also to complete the pack since I only have demo plays oh wait uh demo plays for the game i also bought this cartridge box and this games from shopee i think this cost me all in all this cost me i think less than 500 pesos and a lot of games oh, this is on these are used games they have no boxes so I just have to buy this cartridge box to store them all right let's get to the to this box the inclusions of this so aside from the missing charger uh, what's inside is if you open this I the manual is also missing I don't know where the manual is this one it includes these AR cards. Uh, I'm gonna show you the uh, the use of these AR cards. Maybe in the next video. Just want you. I just want to show you this console. I think this is better than Switch. Uh, the AR cards that is included. Uh, there's Mario here. Uh, oh, Zelda. One that one. Link, Zelda, uh, Kirby. Uh, this is the marble. Oh, I don't. I don't know. This one. So. Okay. So this console was originally released in October 2013. Uh, this is the uh, uh, part of the DS family. Uh, this was released uh, after Nintendo released the Nintendo 3DS. So this is like the uh, 2DS version of the 3DS. Uh, this was made uh, primarily for kids. So as you can see, this is like the uh, this is not the clamshell uh, type of uh, console that you see in the DS. Uh, this is like uh, well some of the Maybe, uh, describe it as a doorstop 
but it is like it fits perfectly in my hands, so I don't care. They say so. It's like the uh, the style of the Game Boy, the the classic Game Boy. So here, these are the controls, and then the home button. There's a mic in there. That you can you can you can use for the games. I will show that to you in my next videos. Then there's the, uh, the speaker. This is a speaker, but this is a mono speaker, so don't get your hopes up. And there's a camera, which in 2013 uh, is beyond the other gadgets. Amazing. Uh, well, there's of, of course there's an iPhone, but for other consoles or other phones aside from the iPhone, because there's also a dual camera system. And then that's the power button so if you would like to pause your game you just have to uh, yeah, you can see that sleep button there okay you just have to uh, push that from to the to the left and then the control button start the select button so and also, included in this console, this is the stylus so, Nintendo. Yeah, Nintendo brand. So when you open this, this is the uh, menu for this console. So download play notifications. I don't use this actually. The settings, of course, this can be the Nintendo Zone, but I think this was the mice already. Then there's the eShop where you can uh, download games, which I also, I, which I believe this was also, this is also used in uh, when downloading Switch games. The Me Ver, the Me Maker like uh, an avatar that you want to make of yourself <laughs> and then the Mi Plaza I think this was also demise due to privacy privacy reasons I don't know just comment below if you know. then the 3DS then the camera so you want don't get your hopes up uh, remember this was released in 2013 so the quality of the camera is not that it's not as good as it is today. Okay. Uh, quite pixelated, but it's fine. It's acceptable, I think. In there, this uh, you can make three D pictures out of it. You can only do that here. So if you send it to a phone, your phone, your mail, you cannot view it in three D. You can only view it. You can only view 3D pictures when you also have this console, did that, this badass console. Okay. So that's it, guys, for this uh, video today. Well, the final verdict. I think uh, price-wise, price-wise, this is better than the Switch, and uh, I enjoyed playing this. <laughs> It awakened the gamer in me, so I enjoyed uh, playing games here. I'm gonna play a lot more. So uh, on my next video, I'm gonna review all the games that I have played here, the in the 218 one. And uh, if you want me to review the uh, uh, other games that can be played in, in in this console, just comment down below. Hit that subscribe button and uh, that notification bell for more updates. So I'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys.